So this is the Toshiba Kirabuk at uh, CBIT 2014. I haven't had a chance to uh, have a look at this one. It was launched uh, Q4 last uh, year, um, and one of the first with a really, really high resolution display. It's a 2000, oh, I have to get it up now, 2640, I believe. Let's just get that one up. 2560 uh, by 1440 is the, the resolution. And it's not just the resolution that's nice, it's a really beautiful screen with a very, very deep IPS angle to it, and actually, this is one of the nicest screens actually out of all the devices that are on display here keyboard um yeah it's a toshiba keyboard um it's not up there with things like the thinkpad and the dell e7440 um is it backlit i'm just checking for the the keyboard back yes it is backlit so uh at least that is good but it's better than the z80 i'll tell you that z830 was a little bit poor and this one's um a lot better than that let's just go around the device and have a little look at the ports, you've got the power button here, USB 3, full SD card slot on that side and then flipping over to the other side we've got full HDMI, two USB uh, ports there, one is uh, sync and charge, uh, they both look like USB 2 ports. Really nice finish on the device, this is, this is metal here and it's a huge trackpad which, uh, which feels pretty good. Now looking at uh, the specs here, we've got 8 gigs of RAM in here, this has got a uh, 10 point touch, it's not got a digitizer layer, this has got the Core i7, I'm pretty sure you can get this with a, a vPro uh, version as well. Harman Kardon speakers, we've got uh, AC uh, wireless on here, there's no NFC uh, and there's no GPS chip in here and no 3G in this version, there may be versions with uh, 3G, but it's a beautiful device, it's not cheap, as, uh, cheap but it's uh, it's a beautiful looking device. That's the uh, Toshiba Kira or Kira Book um, at CBIT 2014 Microsoft booth. My name's Chibi. Thanks for watching.